First, a duck tail plaguing an Elmwood family and pestering city officials. Thanks for joining us. I'm Mark Welp. Shelby Roberts has the night off. Our Durante Matthews is with us live in studio to show us the duck drama flocking up social media. Durante. And Mark, it's definitely one of the more interesting things on social media right now. And Elmwood family says the city is forcing them to get rid of their pet ducks and with less than 14 days left to do so. But city reps say this is nothing personal. It's just part of an ordinance that's been in place for more than two decades. <laughs> Six ducks quacking and roaming freely in the backyard has been the norm for Stacy Murphy's family for the past year and a half. I post them all over my Facebook. Um, I've had them out on Halloween out front. All my neighbors know about them. But last Thursday, she says she got the news that a city council member spotted them and the ducks had to go. It was a surprise that I had to get rid of them for someone seeing them. Not complaining about them, but just seeing them. City officials tell us Elmwood has had an ordinance for more than 20 years prohibiting certain livestock within city limits. I swore it said that you could have them, they just couldn't be free range and no roosters. I obviously was misinformed. With less than two weeks to get rid of the ducks, the family created an online petition for support and took the matter to Facebook, resulting in an explosion of duck puns, memes, and posts. City officials say the ordinance is in place basically to keep from attracting predators and so neighbors won't have to deal with farm animals. Depending on how clean they kept that situation, there's often some smell issues with, you know, thing, with fowl and chickens and birds. Davis says exceptions are properties that are zoned agriculture and nature. We're an understanding community. We're not, you know, anti-animal or anti-doc. It's just an ordinance, like I said, that's been on the books for years. Murphy says her goal is to go through the city council and change that ordinance. And if need be, she's willing to have someone keep her ducks during the process. We are a farm town, so I don't see why we can't have a few little farm animals. And back in March, we also brought to you a story of another Elmwood woman looking to change that same ordinance prohibiting her from having chickens. Now, that matter is still pending.